Hello, uh, my name is Jussi Vakkanen, and I'm here to talk to you about CMakeifying the C++ standard library. Now, specifically, this talk is not about compiling the standard library with CMake. Like, why would you do that? Don't do that. Instead, um, what we find is that C++ has a lot of stuff in it. Uh, there's integers, there's strings, and priority queues, and everything. And what we need to realize is that all of this is unnecessary. All of these things should be thrown away and replaced with the one true data structure, that is, STD string. <laughs> Absolutely everything. And this has massive benefits. For example, if you have integers, you would have a string which says what the integer is. Very simple. If you have a struct, it would be uh, separated by a semicolon of the intents. Arrays are the same. Classes are the same. They have the same representation. You can toggle between them. STD vector, value, semicolon, value, semicolon. Also, standard map, you have key, semicolon value, semicolon key, and so on. And also, even unordered map. Look how easy it is to remove things from this. You just take it there. There's no tombstones. You don't really care about rehashing. Everything is so much simpler. And there are other advantages as well. Uh, you don't need name mangling because there's only one type. ABI stability is trivial. You don't have to do anything at all. Uh, you get the small size optimization for all containers because there is only one container. And even better, you get it for types. So if you have one single character, it only takes 23 bytes to store it as opposed to 24 and a malloc. Think about the savings. You don't need templates because there is only one type. Templates become unnecessary. You just write your algorithm for string and it works for everything. And this cuts down on comp compilation time. There's no code flow. There's only one function for any piece of functionality. You don't need reflection. Everything is serializable. You just write it out to files, write it out to sockets. It just, you don't need to do anything. This is so awesome. Uh, for John Lakers, you don't need allocators because everything is densely packed. Just one allocation for all, everything. It's just, whoosh, there you go. Uh, no diffusion and nothing like that. Uh, some people might say in the audience, okay, but this is going to cause performance problems. No, this actually will improve performance. For example, if you have an X vector of strings and want to convert it to a vector of integers, that's an O0 operation, which is formally optimal. You cannot do this faster. Also, uh, you get to do things like this. So if you have regular integers and you add them, this is boring, it's slow, you can do it only at one at a time. But if your integer is a string, you get to do SIMD accelerated integers. Look at all the lanes you can have in here. Like every single one of these columns is a single lane that you can do. And you can do addition with SIMD, even with basic integers. And you get all of the performance benefits. And uh, so in conclusion, but if you think about it, apart from readability, performance, buggable initiation, architectural foundation, and preventing your entire code base from collapsing, what have types ever done for us? <laughs>